Hello you guys! Okay, today's video is a little bit different than something Brooklyn and I have ever done before. This last year, a thing called like the color test or like the color palette test has been trending. It's you get to see what colors match the best with your like skin tone and what you should be wearing and what complements you. Today we are going to be officially taking our color palette test. They put on the warm colors immediately, one color, and I was like, no. I really don't like wearing the color red. Dakota, guess what Brooklyn ended up being? You guys, I literally had an eyelash on my face the entire time in that intro. Brooklyn has shown up to the office. Okay, get a good look, guys. We're probably gonna be the same. I don't know, because the hair really makes a difference, I think. Okay, Brooklyn just said, what did you just say? He said, what if she tells you you're a silver girl? And my ring is literally Everything you rose, wear is gold. rose gold. What if she tells you you're a silver girl? I used to wear silver, now I wear gold. <laughs> we would be genuinely so shocked. I would be shocked. Okay, we're each gonna go around and predict what we think my colors are, and then what Brooklyn's colors are, and then we're gonna, of course, show the results at the end and see who was right. Spring is like yellows and red, summer. Blue, pink, autumn, autumn brown, like green, yellow. neutrals. Winter, purple, and pink. Yeah. Okay, what do you think I am? A winter. Think I'm a winter? <laughs> yeah, based on this color thing, yeah. Okay. <laughs> and what about you? Maybe a summer or an autumn. All right, what season do you think you are? I think I'm a winter too. Oh. Now look, if we're going off this one, I think I'm and a winter. And what about me? I'm gonna say you're an autumn. An autumn. Yes, like the neutrals, the browns, the greens. Okay, we are now FaceTiming Dakota because we're curious to see what the boys think. It's not winter, it's not spring. I'm thinking summer. That's what I said. I'm gonna go for winter for you. Okay. And I'm gonna say autumn for you. I mean, I'm colorblind, so it's really tough. You would normally probably wear summer. It's just a lot of like light pinks and stuff. We've got it set up all up in here, and this lovely lady's doing our color test Hello. today. Do you wanna say hi and introduce yourself? Sure, I'm Erin Morgan with House of Color. Um, I'm from Dallas, I live in Dallas, and I'm excited to be here. Can you guys tell she does this Look at how she's popping off in this dress, TBH. This is so awesome. This is kind of what we were looking at this morning. So we were guessing who's with what. So this is like a much more intricate version of what we were looking at this morning. I know, it has like two colors. We have made our predictions and then all the setup, you guys. And then we'll be chilling in this chair while she does the tests. I am about to be mind blown if Brooklyn and I do or don't. I really think actually we have different color palettes. So if we end up having the same color palette, I think that's what's gonna blow my mind. But I want you all to comment down below before you see the results, what you think our color palettes will be. And then at the end, comment again and tell me if you are right or wrong. I have to wear this. She said that the hair, like the color in my hair could be distracting. See, I'm saying the color of the hair would change it. Mm -hmm. So now we're taking that away, then we really yeah. might be so the same color. Yeah, wow. There you go, just pull it to wow. like your hairline. Wow. If it's gorgeous. So what I do is I layer a warm color on you and then I put a cool color on top and I pull the cool one off and we watch to see what changes. So I'm looking at your overall skin tone. These are cool and this is warm. I do see a change in your skin tone, yeah. for sure. Yeah. I'm like, I don't want to say which one I prefer. It's like, what if I'm not wrong? And <laughs> she's like, no, the other one actually looks <laughs> better. <laughs> okay, so we have cool and warm. Mm. We don't want to see your skin go dull. We don't want to see you kind of lose that vibrancy or brightness. It almost should look like you have a filter or makeup on when you don't, right? Very even, very smooth. I would say so far, I like what's happening to you in the cooler colors. Do you agree? I agree. It's not it's more like, like even. Yeah. Isn't that wild? Yeah. yeah so it's, weird. These are the warm ones. Yeah. Bye, bye, <laughs> Autumn. Told y'all. I told y'all. <laughs> Already she's saying that they lean towards cool colors, so that automatically <laughs> eliminates <laughs> Autumn. <laughs> <laughs> so we may have been wrong. Cool. Warm. And it's not really that there's like a lot of like unevenness coming out, but it's just that you go a little dull, right? In the warm colors. And as soon as we pull up a cooler color, you just get that life back in your skin. Interesting. So crazy. So you will either be a winter or a summer. So. Oh, okay, so it says you really are already wrong. <laughs> okay, now that we know she's a cool tone. I'm saying summer. Okay, I'm going summer too. Summer. <laughs> 
So we've confirmed that I have like cooler undertones. I've got blue undertones. So now we are testing the difference between summer and winter, which are the two seasons that have blue undertones. Let's see, I voted for summer. We will see if yeah, I have a summer. You did originally. I voted and so did Dakota, both <sighs> summer. Who's gonna be right? Winter. Now we're saying winter. <laughs> she just explained that basically like the pop of color will be missing if you are a summer, you will look really good with the pop of color. And I think Brooklyn will look really good with the pop of color. So, winter. So I would say so far, I do feel like the summer colors are a little yes. bit soft. You go a little bit like one dimensional. Yes. Would you say that you kind of see that? I don't know. Oh, I do. Wait, 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 say it again, say it again. is a winter. <laughs> Wait, does this mean she has to wear silver gold or mm -hmm. silver? Oh, silver? You're a silver girl! How do you feel about that? Not me with a gold wedding ring. <laughs> <laughs> no hair nut for me. You are lucky. I'm warm on you first, and this, these are both warm. It's that shirt and jacket again. No. <laughs> immediately. <laughs> they put on the warm colors immediately, one color, and I was like, no. So fun because you guys do have such different skin tones. See? But we're looking at the undertone, which is what's so fascinating about it. Yeah, fun fact, guys, if you didn't know this, I really don't like wearing the color red. I don't know why. Or brown. <laughs> or brown. <laughs> okay, so we've got cool, warm. Okay, yeah, that's an obvious <laughs> answer for Sorry. Me. <laughs> Again, you just look much more even, much more bright mm -hmm. here than with that one. Just color that too. Bad. Yeah, I love this color too. Not yes. your color is the worst <laughs> color on me ever. <laughs> yeah, you both just go very kind of flat with that warm color, and then as soon as we pull this up, it's like you pop again. Clear, also that you have blue undertones, but let's do the light one again just to see. Winter and summer. Yeah. Cool tone, cool tone. So far, we're the same. Guys, I'm the problem child. Difficult. We have to do some more testing. There's some winter colors, right? We're just gonna kind of lay them here so you can see them. Summer. Oh my gosh. I just think the summer colors yeah. are so like pleasing to the eye yeah. with you, right? Okay, the good thing about being a summer, I can wear rose gold. <laughs> <laughs> so therefore, that's good. Dakota, guess what Brooklyn ended up being? I was right, summer. No, she's a winter. The dark colors? Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. Definitely your summer. No, I'm winter. No, you're not. Yes, I am. <laughs> Look what color you're wearing right now. <laughs> you do not wear those colors. I know, but when we held them up to me, they were the colors I looked the best. Are you shocked? Oh, they look the best, and I thought the colors you always no, wear. No, that I look the best in. No, that's crazy. <laughs> Okay, so part of it is that we gotta get like a 90 second makeover based off of like the season that we are and like what lipstick shades look good, what blush shades look good. So this was my 90 second makeover and Bailey is currently getting hers done. Okay, now that we've got some coordinating lipstick and blush on for our colors, now we're going to pick our wow colors, which are like the ones that pop the most. This one I'm so excited for because I am dying to know. Colors are dark colors and purples. Guys. So you're a dark, Summer. And you're gonna be a light winter? <laughs> are we gonna like all be like this close like this? to each other? <laughs> you are falling into what we call our sultry winter. <laughs> sultry winter. <laughs> Everyone in the office, including Brooklyn and I, guessed that I was a winter. You were the only one that guessed I was a summer. And I am a summer. <laughs> Let's go! Maybe y'all are colorblind, not me. <laughs> How did you know? Just look at you, I guess. <laughs> I, just, I just know what you like to well, wear. Well, now I'm gonna take you shopping with me every time so you can tell well, me what Whatever Asa says looks good. Whatever Asa says looks good, looks good. The only one that was right on their predictions was 
A sub mm -hmm. for me. Yeah. And who was right about That's you? Just no you. one. No one? No one. The interesting part was that we were completely different colors. Turns out identical twins do not have to have the same color palette. No. Interestingly enough. Who knew? Comment down below if y'all guessed correct or if you were completely wrong. And we will see y'all next week. Bye, Bye y'all.